The biggest issue for you right now as a new day trader is simple. There is too much fucking information on the internet today about day trading. And all of this information is conflicting. You have people who say, don't do this. You have people who say, don't do that. You have people to say, use this indicator. Don't use that indicator. What indicator is best? Who has the best method? Who is the best day trader? It's constantly conflicting information about what is the best possible way to learn to day trade. You have a hundred different YouTubers saying a hundred different things. And I believe this is actually detrimental for many day traders who are starting out today. Let's talk about the information overload and what you should really do right here in this video as a new day trader. Let's go. So the question is, am I a hypocrite for making a video about information on day trading and telling you that all the other information out there is wrong and well, you should only follow my strategy, buy my course, subscribe to my YouTube channel because everybody else is doing it wrong. Well, that would be very hypocritical of me, right? Making this video right now, talking about there being too much information while I'm also giving you more information. I wanna make it very clear, very simple. At the end of the day, there is only one, one very important thing to learn when it comes to day trading, and that's simply price action. Now that's the one technical idea that you need to learn when it comes to day trading, the actual price action. Understanding that when the price is going higher, buyers are coming in, volumes going up, understanding this is a ripe opportunity to jump in long. The same way that when the market's showing weakness, it's selling off, sellers are taking control, that is a ripe opportunity to jump in short. The problem is you have so many people with conflicting information on the internet today. So when you first start out as a day trader, hopefully you end up on my YouTube channel first, but probably not because there's a lot of other larger YouTubers out there that are telling you certain things to do, buy this, do that, use this indicator, trade options, trade penny stocks, buy this stock, sell that stock, don't own this stock. There is so much fucking information out there right now that there's just too much information. And again, who is really vetting any of this information? There is nobody actually fact checking this information. Nobody actually knows that if you know I have any idea what I'm doing, people see me do it live on YouTube, but is that still to say that I am an expert by any means? No, what works best for me, buying momentum, selling weakness, things like that, you guys see that the way I trade is very simple with price action, looking for breakouts and breakdowns. I do believe that my strategy is not so much the easiest to replicate, but it's the easiest to understand in the sense of like, hey, why is Patrick buying? Why is Patrick getting short? All right, wait, okay, yeah, it's breaking an opening range. The 15 minute candle's breaking, it's going up. He's buying, he's getting long. It's very simple to understand my strategy. And that's what I do think is valuable about my channel and about the way that I trade. People can look at my videos and be like, oh, he bought when it broke over the high of that last candle. Like, oh, oh, look, he shorted when it broke below the view op. Oh, look, he bought when it bounced off the view op. These are all very simple ideas where, you know, someone like ICT, or some of these other guys out there that have like a million different concepts that you have to learn. You've got to watch thousands and thousands of hours of videos to even understand the first concept. I think this is really bad for a new day trader because it creates analysis paralysis, right? It makes it so that every single entry you're looking at, you're like, wait, I'm confused. Is this, should I, wait, what? So you create this doubt in your mind because you don't really understand the strategy itself. And it's not to say that ICT doesn't know what he's doing and not to say that some other guru doesn't know what they're doing. They have years of experience trading their system. They have years of experience trading their system, right? Think about that. You are a new day trader coming along and then trying to start trading an advanced system. You're coming along with very little experience in the market and you're trying to learn a very advanced system. And that's a big no-no. If you don't even understand the simple ideas of trading, how do you think you're gonna understand the advanced ideas of trading? So I would say, as a new day trader here in 2023, the best thing that you can do is simply try to tune out pretty much everything and just focus on the charts. 
watch the charts, see the price action, understand, oh wow, look, the market's pushing up. It broke above the previous high of day. Oh look, it's breaking below the previous low of day. Understanding where these levels are, seeing how the price action is moving around these levels. If we bounce off the VWAP, if we get stuck at the VWAP, these are all things that you just have to learn. One video, five minutes, 10 minutes of watching a video, understanding a concept, a strategy, is not going to make you profitable. It's not going to make it so that when you're looking at the chart and that strategy pops up, you're not going to be like, hey, wait a second, I watched a five minute video. I know exactly what to do. The only way you're going to get to a point where you're able to execute and take profit, cut off your losers, and actually day trade consistently is by doing it consistently. You have to just kind of show up every day, put in the work, even if it's not trading real money, even if it's not even trading in general, you really need to be in front of the charts. You need to be watching, you need to be understanding, and then asking yourself like, hey, what's the market gonna do? Okay, it's gonna go up, I think. And then if it goes up, you're like, okay, why did I believe it was gonna go up? Okay, it was gonna go up because it bounced off a previous level, whatever it is. You need to start asking questions on why you think the market's gonna move, why you think it's gonna get stuck, these certain things. And then when they play out, you want to reward yourself because, hey, look, you know, I, I saw the level there. The market pushed up to that level. It got stuck. That would have been a really good short opportunity. But just sitting on YouTube all day, watching videos over and over and over, trying to learn a strategy is not going to make you consistent. It's not going to actually give you this serious edge that you're searching for. The only way you can create that edge is by putting in the actual work and showing up. So as a new day trader, the best thing you could do is just start day trading in the sense of like having the charts pulled up, looking at the levels, understanding where their key levels are, watching those levels, and then seeing like, hey, the market keeps bouncing off the previous low of day. Hey, this is happening. Understanding these little things, building up that muscle memory because just watching some guy on YouTube trying to copy that guy, trying to watch his video to learn his strategy is not going to make you profitable. It's not going to make you consistent until you just freaking start doing it. And then you've got to battle the emotions. So it's one thing to learn a strategy, right? You learned a strategy. Now you've got to battle the emotions. And that's like 90% of day trading. Learning a strategy, finding a strategy like, okay, I'm going to buy the opening range breakout. I'm going to short the opening range breakdown. Like that can be taught very easily. You can understand that very quickly. But then getting to a point where you pull the trigger, you cut off your losers, you take profit, those things actually executing that strategy, that's a whole different ball game. And that only comes with experience in the market, doing it over and over and over. I've been trading for seven years now, and I still struggle some days with the emotion going on tilt, you know, fighting the market, whatever it is, I still struggle with that. So if you're a new trader and you're like, man, this crap's hard. Well, imagine seven years from now, my friend, like seven years is still going to be hard. It never gets easy, but we get to a point where we start to, okay, I know what I need to not do. I know what I need to do and you do it, right? Like you follow that strategy, you focus on it and you focus on your emotions. You focus on taking profit. You learn over and over. Like you get burnt so many times holding on to a loser that finally you're like, okay, I'm no longer going to hold on to that loser. I'm going to cut it off. I've learned my lesson. I have learned my lesson to the point of like, it's probably not a good idea to hold on to that loser anymore. Like it's probably just a good idea to take my loss and wait for the next trade. These are all things that you have to just learn from experience. So you've got to get rid of all that information, all this conflicting information, the thousand different strategies, the thousand different ideas on trading. And you just got to focus on yourself. You got to find that little strategy, the simplest you can go. Make it so simple that you can explain it to a 10-year-old. Make your strategy so simple that you can explain it to someone who's never day traded, that you can explain it to a 10-year-old. Once you do that, you do it over and over and over, you can build on it. You can make it more advanced. You can add more indicators. You can figure out little ways to make it better, how to fine-tune it. But until you get to a point where you have a strategy that is so simple that you can explain it to anyone, you don't have a strategy. You got to get to a point where your strategy is so simple that you can explain it and you can own it. You can believe it. You can put in the work and you know every day I'm going to show up. I'm going to trade this strategy. This is my strategy. I own this strategy. 
right? And then I'm going to build on that. I'm going to build the emotions. I'm going to build the rules. I'm going to build everything on top of that very simple strategy. I'm not going to go try to copy some guy who's been trading for 20 years. I'm not going to go try to copy some guy who's been trading for five years. I'm not going to go try to copy anyone on freaking YouTube in the first place. But in general, guys, keep it simple. The simpler, the better. That's my biggest piece of advice for any new day trader is there's too much information. Just focus on the simple price action. Focus on finding a very simple strategy and doing it over and over and over, over and over. Get rid of all the information and focus on the strategy, my friends. Simple is easy. Simple makes money. Don't overcomplicate trading. Let's go.